Hi everyone. Today I will be making braised mushroom chicken with uh, noodles. First, I will boil the chicken first. I'm gonna clean it under the water, the, the cold water, and then I will put all the measurement in the description box. I cook the chicken for five minutes. And now I put it under the cold water. And then we're gonna cook it the chicken with all the sauces for 20 minutes to 30 minutes. We're gonna check again. And uh, we will take it with a uh, potato starch later for the sauce. The chicken is cooking now. So it's, it's basically it tastes like a gingerish uh, braised chicken. So with all this, we're gonna throw it away. It's 10 minutes of cooking now. And I already lower the heat to medium. And I put a uh, shallots in there. And then we're gonna come back in 10 minutes and have a look. And we will thicken it with a uh, potato starch. Yeah, the smell is there, it's good. I'm cooking this in a medium heat, only 25 minutes. And now, I'm gonna throw away this uh, the shallot that I put earlier. And now I'm gonna put it on a high heat, and I will thicken it with a potato starch. Potato starch, now we take it. That's good enough. And now I'm making a soup, a side soup. And this is the one that I put. All this, and I use the anchovies as the stock. I'm gonna put some sugar. A bit of salt, and I will using um, gyoza. This gyoza, and I will put it together, boil it. After boiling for ten minutes, and uh, I'm gonna take out the gyoza now, so it won't be overcooked and break. Now, after taking out the stock, I will strain it. This is stock. And we throw away all the anchovies. And now we're gonna boil the noodle, but we have to be really, really boiling. This is the one portion. What I do, pull up on the packet, I loosen it up. So, and then I'm getting ready a cold water. Do have a cold water there? So after we put it in the cold water, and then we will put it back to cook it again for probably two minutes. To make sure that it's boiling hot. Else they are stuck together. I'm gonna pull the noodle straight now and put it in cold water. Make sure it's boiling. Put the cooling in the cold water. Very quickly, we just wait, make sure it's boiling. It's the final stages of cooking the noodle. Now, as you can see, it's springy. Yeah, it's springy now. So, good. Let's do now. I'm gonna turn it off and then I'm gonna assemble everything together. Now, I'm gonna assemble all the food together. So this one, the noodle thing there. That's the sauce. Just put two first. Yeah. And give it a good mix. And then one more. This is mix. Noodles. That was good enough. Plate. Put 
Wedgie on the side. You can put this one on the side too if you want to. Uh, There's a mushroom. There's a chicken. It tastes like a gingery chicken. It does uh, take some time to make this dish, but because of lockdown, so I try to find something to do. In Sydney, the lockdown is still ongoing, so it's pretty bad here in Sydney. So let's try to find something to make myself occupied. And I did make some uh, garlic oil. This is you can put it on top. Yeah, and some put some pepper if you want to. Some sesame oil, just to give it a tang flavor. A bit of soup. The soup you can put this too as well if you want to. Here's the soup. So it's fine. And here's a here's the anchovy stock that we made earlier. So it's pretty easy and simple. Like I say, you have time, yeah, you can do these kind of things. Hopefully this lockdown is going to be over soon. You can back to normal at least. Hopefully. You have some uh, shallots. I like, the, I like the shallot that is end part. So you get it more flavor. And you can put some here too, if you want to. And I can put some of this. This is a fried shallot. If you want to. Some. Pepper as well. Sesame oil. Yeah, it's up to you what you want to put. But I like the I like the, the um, garlic oil with this. It's really nice. So there you go, friend. Here's my version of braised chicken noodle. And then I make a soup with the gyoza. I need a bit more. A bit more of the soup will be nice. There you go. Yeah, stay safe, guys, everyone. So this is this is the dish that I make today.